Hi, so we're in a different area. We're on the bookshelves, not in front of them, we're on them. And I'm tired and I'm trying to play Sims, but I'm not having any fun with it. And I'm reading a book and it's okay. <laughs> So I wanted to film a video talking about all the books that I want to read, but probably won't because that's who I am as a person, a reader, and so here we go. <laughs> so I definitely do want to read these, and I'd like to, well first of all, I have to reread the first two. I'd like to reread Dorothy Must Die and The Wicked Will Rise, both of which are by Danielle Page, who I follow on Twitter, and she follows me as well. So that's cool. But I want to finish this series, and I haven't yet. But I would really like to finish it. So I gotta read The Yellow Brick War and The End of Oz. But to read those two, I'd like to reread the first two, because I, like, I remember what happened. I, my mom and I are watching The Night Shift for the first time in like four years and I literally, and we're watching season one and I'm like, oh, do you remember what happens? I do. I was like, ah, uh, there it is. Just clicked. I know. I know what happens. Do you know what happens, mom? So I do remember basic things in this, but I would like to reread them um, because I want to get the full experience of this series. So. I'd also like to finish the Darkest Mind series. I have In the Afterlight, and then I got the little collections that I gotta read still. I'd like to finish this, but I feel like to finish, to read this one, I need to reread the first two, just like Dorothy Must Die. But this series is more fresh in my mind. I remember what happens in ne Never Fade. Um, and I just don't feel like this is a series I could reread. I don't think I like it enough, and I like I don't think it's one of those things that I would enjoy enough to reread another time, especially because it's still so fresh in my mind. I just can't think that I would enjoy rereading this series. So I've also really got, got into like I've this entire year I've kind of been like like I have this like day where I'm like I really want to read a thriller. And today is one of those days as I'm filming this. For some reason, I just really want to read All the Missing Girls by Megan Miranda. I don't know why, but I have two thrillers on my shelf. I'd actually like to finally read these things because there's like all these thrillers that sound good, but I just never, I don't want to buy them and <laughs> until I read the other two thrillers that I already have. So I already I have All the Missing Girls by Megan Miranda and The Wife Between Us by Greer Hendricks and Sarah Pekinen. These are my two thrillers. My mom has some thrills that I have on my shelf, but these are mine and I would like to read them eventually. Because I do wanna try thrillers. I actually started this one. Let's see how far did I get into it. I got 12 pages into it. Wow, really gave this one a try, didn't I? <laughs> I'd also like to read uh, Ivy Aberdeen's Letters to the World by Ashley Herring Blake. This is a little middle, gr middle grade, and it's about a girl who's discovering her sexuality. And um, I picked it up because it's for Detective Thon, like Detective Thon, and it's a. Uh, and it was for there, and I was like, oh, this sounds interesting. And I was like, yeah, I should pick it up. And I was like, maybe I'll cry during this. But it's, I'm not really a contemporary reader, so I don't know. But it's middle grade, so I should like it, you know what I mean? But I would like to read this too soon. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> this one's weird, because, yeah, I've had this on my shelf for a long time too. But, um, some, I... On somebody on booktube I was watching was taught that oh JD Ray reads and hauled this book and I was like you know what I should read that book and give it a try oh wow that's annoying how long has that been doing that um and that is Girls Made of Snow and Glass by Melissa Bastardhouse this I just want to read to see if I'm going to like it it's just such a tall it's just such a tall hardcover which means there's so many words on a page, which means it's going to take a little bit longer to read it. Unless it's good, I guess. I don't know, but I would like to read this. Maybe I'll start this today. I 
I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just talking about all these books that I'd like to finally read. But, uh, yeah. We know what I'm doing. You're watching this video, so. Those are currently all of them that are, like, calling out to me. I would like to read The Laws of Locke Lamora by Scott Lynch. Like, this is a really pretty copy of it. And I've started it a few times, and I just haven't been able to, like, get into it. Um, but I do want to read this, um, because I've heard it's really good. And I think it's got, like, assassins in it, or it's got thieves in it. And, ugh, sweetie, I love assassins, and I love thieves, as long as they're fictional. I don't like actual IRL thieves, but I do love myself some fictional ones. But... I started Mistborn here. I started Mistborn and I'm I got a hundred pages exactly wow into this and I put it down because I was so unentertained. So maybe I don't like thieves because this is about like a heist or something for magic. I don't know, but I wasn't very interested in Mistborn, so I don't really know. Uh, anyway. I'm going to end this video here because this is going to be, this is it, this is all I got. So, yeah, thanks for watching this video. It was weird and stuff like that. Um, oh, I guess I technically have one more thriller. It's truly devious, but this is like a YA thriller, so I don't know how thrilling it's actually, how thrilling it actually is, but, um, yeah. So, thanks so much for watching this video. I know it was very low-end and... I don't know, I didn't come in here with a plan, but I wanted to talk about these books that I'm getting the itch to read, but I don't read them, so we're doing good, we're really doing good, maybe just today, because what I'm currently reading, I'm kind of like in a lull of, I don't know, I don't know. Anyway, thanks for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give me a big fat thumbs up and subscribe down below because I post videos on this channel every single Monday. And if you have any videos you'd like to see from this channel, please tell me in the comment section because I haven't been posting every single Monday because I don't have any video ideas. So if you guys have some video ideas, please tell them to me so I actually have some video ideas as well because I don't have any and I'd like some. So yeah, uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you guys all next Monday for another video. And hey, don't forget, I'm still a freaky bulldozer. Bye guys.